guys. So I went on Facebook probably, probably I want to say about a month ago. I asked you guys if you guys wanted to see me talk through some never before seen footage. There we go. Wow, what a tongue twister. And um, a lot of you guys said yes. And um, so I was like, all right. So um, that's what I am doing now. And you have no idea how painful this is for me right now. So um, this was back in 2014, which was almost three years ago now. So obviously the dancing is not what it looks like nowadays. I'm going to stop rambling. We're going to get into this. Um, all right. Oh my God. <laughs> I am so nervous right now. This is so nerve wracking. I don't know why. Probably because I know that s some of this stuff is bad. So, ugh, okay. All right, let's just do it. All right. Okay, so I'm walking on. Point your feet. Oh my God. All right, so I'm not on the music. Okay, so we're doing Princess and the Frog, by the way. I'm gonna pause it. I wrote the story, actually, <laughs> funny enough. Um, me and my teacher and um, my friend Renee, and at the time there was a girl there, her name was Olivia, and trying to put our heads together to come up with what performance we should do. And we were like, oh, Princess and the Frog, that's so cute, it's, you know, and that sort of thing. So I looked up the story, and I wrote my own kind of story. So we kind of mixed a little bit of a few other fairy tales with this one. But this one right here is the dance of the golden ball. Basically, the princess is in love with the golden ball. So if you can't tell, um, I have to act like I am in love with the golden ball. Oh my god, this is so embarrassing! <laughs> yeah, that wasn't horrible. Oh my goodness. This is so terrible. Bent legs, unpointed feet. Oh my gosh. I was 13 years old, by the way, at this point in time. Oh my god, that torjete was terrible, and I could have faked that so much better. That was me looking into the font. <laughs> okay, my acting skills, you have to understand. My acting skills suck. I mean, I've definitely gotten better now, but I sucked at that time at acting. It was just so embarrassing for me. Okay, so this is after I'd um, lost the ball, basically, and I'm very sad about my ball being gone. Dancing with that ball was a pain in the butt, by the way. Oh, that legs. And I'm in a tutu the entire time. Whose idea was that? <laughs> I wanted, I actually think that was um, my teacher's decision. I was like, oh yeah, I can totally do it in a tutu. No, you can't. And these were the days when I could not get my legs at all, even above 45. It was so hard for me. I had no flexibility whatsoever. <laughs> Oh, hopping, hopping, okay. Okay, this one actually wasn't so bad, this part right here. I definitely could have pointed my feet more on the walks, but I mean, we're very judgmental towards ourselves as dancers. Okay, so this little boy, I actually teach him now, and his acting skills were amazing, and he had me actually laughing on stage. It was so bad. <laughs> That's how bad of an act actress I was, is that I was actually laughing at his acting. <laughs> He's a very talented young boy too. Oh my gosh, this is so painful to watch, you have no idea. My legs are so bent and I'm just standing there. Uh, this is terrible. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so let's take a look at this next portion. This was the contemporary solo that me and my teacher had choreographed together. Um, and this was done after the entire ballet was over. So it was definitely, ex we were 
I, I was exhausted. So yeah, I had a very fast, quick change right out of that into um, the next costume for this piece. So yeah, let's take a look at that, huh? That was pretty. That was one of my favorite parts. This right here was one of my favorite parts of the entire piece. This entire piece, this whole part right here. It was one of my favorite parts to dance and also to watch. <laughs> I'm like, oh, that wasn't so horrible. I really like this part too. I think I did that part really well. I'm not gonna lie. part wasn't too bad. Okay, so this was before I could actually land that without popping, but that was actually not bad. Especially for being 13 years old and that being my first time doing that. Well, obviously like not my first time, but you know, first time on stage. That roll was really kind of terrible. I think my dress got caught under me, and so then it was just doomed from the start. Point your feet! Point your feet! Point your feet! Point your feet! Point your feet. <laughs> oh, fell down. That's okay. arms aren't the greatest, but I mean, I will say, I think for being after an entire like hour and a half ballet and a quick change, this actually isn't bad at all. Oh, okay, so the next part is the, um, one of the other girls solos, but uh, we had to end in like a modeling pose. I look back at it, I'm like, oh god, turn away. Um, but yeah, in all honesty, I think I did really well. I was an advanced foundation at this time, so that was almost, like I said earlier, almost three years ago, and oh god. Um, it's so weird looking back on this, like, because you... After that show, I was really proud of myself and I was like, oh, like I did so well. But like nowadays, like knowing, like having the knowledge that I have and that sort of thing, I'm just like, oh my God, like that was terrible. I'm going to say as much as it pains me watching this back, I think I did pretty well. So yeah. <laughs> so I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I hope that you guys are got a laugh out of this at least. <laughs> Uh, this was definitely, definitely hard to watch for me um, in some ways, and so I am kind of a little bit embarrassed, but yeah, I'm about to put this up on YouTube and show it to the world, so no, I love you guys so much. I know you guys are all very, very supportive of me, so thank you very much. Um, yeah, I love you guys so much, and I will see you guys on Wednesday. Please give this a video a thumbs up, and if you are new to my channel, please subscribe, and if you guys want to see more videos like this, definitely let me know, and I will definitely do that for you. So, yeah, I will see you guys on Wednesday. Love you guys.